Hi guys! Today I'm going to show you how you can make delicious organic almond milk right in the comfort of your own home. For this recipe you will need 1 cup of soaked almonds 4 cups of purified water 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract 1 fourth cup of agave nectar 1 pinch of sea salt and a cheesecloth or a nut bag. You're going to want to soak your almonds overnight for up to two days. This will release the phytic acid, which will make them easier to digest. Then when you're ready to make your milk, you want to drain the almonds and rinse them until your water looks clean. First you want to put in your 1 cup of almonds, then you want to add your 4 cups of purified water, you may find that the almond milk is more watery than what you're used to, so to make your almond milk thicker, use less water. You want to make sure your blender is on its highest setting and then go ahead and blend it for two minutes. Once all the almond pieces are crushed up and smooth, you can then add your flavoring. For the vanilla flavoring, add one teaspoon of vanilla extract, or feel free to add an actual vanilla bean. Now to add some sweetener, put in one fourth cup of agave nectar. And some other alternatives for sweeteners are dates, honey, stevia or maple syrup. Lastly, you want to add one pinch of sea salt, which really adds to the flavor. Now you just want to blend it again for about one minute. Now it's time to milk the nuts, so you want to get your cheesecloth or nut bag and make sure it's over a big bowl or the container of your choice. And taking the blender, you want to pour the milk over the cloth and let it slowly start to strain through. Then you want to pick up each of the ends of the cloth and start twisting and squeezing around the almond milk to assist the milking process. This whole process should take a minute or two. Once it's all finished, you want to do a taste test, especially if it's your first time making it, so you can make sweetening or flavoring adjustments according to your personal tastes. Now go ahead and store this in whatever container you'd like and keep it in your fridge for about 3-5 to five days. Here is the finished almond milk. I hope you enjoy this recipe and share it with your friends and family. Thank you for watching!